Oh my god, man, you're not gonna believe what I just found. This is so crazy, it's gonna blow your mind. Uh, okay, what's up? Oh my god, it's, it's just absolutely insane. Are you sure you're ready to hear this? Yeah, sure, man. Okay, okay. Are you really sure? Yeah, I'm ready. Bring it on. Okay, okay. <clears throat> Cole is still alive. <laughs> nice April Fool's joke, man. No, man, no, it's not a, it's not an April Fool's joke. I'm dead serious. Oh, really? Yeah, absolutely. So you're as serious as Cole is dead, right? No. Oh, so you're not serious. No, I am serious, man. I'm, I'm dead serious. So you're as dead serious as Cole is seriously dead. Look, man, can you stop with the word games? You're confusing me. Will you just hear me out, please? Dude, I heard you out the last 50 times you came to me with this crazy idea. Yeah, yeah, I know, but this time is different, okay? I have proof this time. I have evidence. And what evidence would that be? Okay, so there's this place I found called Zeke's, right? And it's like a building, and it has the name Zeke on it, and it's a place where bands can go and perform, and it's like a, an event center kind of place, all right? You do realize there are like a million people out there named Zeke. Anybody could have opened that place. Yeah, yeah, I, I know, okay? That, that is, that's not important, that's not important. I believe that Zeke owns the place, and he has Cole's body in the basement, and he's gonna hook him up to this big machine that he built all by himself, and he's gonna revive him. That is the dumbest thing I've ever heard. No, it isn't. Think about how cool it would be if he came back. Dude, Cole died so people like me could stay awesome. Well, I mean, I guess, but... I'm so awesome they made a video game of me. Top that. Well, Cole had three games made about him. Psh, whatever. What surprises me is the fact that you don't think he would have gotten a proper burial seven years ago. But you see, that's the thing. We don't know where Cole was buried, so we don't even know if he had a proper burial or not. So you're saying that after seven years of being a dead corpse, his body is just perfectly intact and ready to be brought back to life. Well, you see, here's, here's the thing that nobody else noticed, okay? No, I'm the only one who noticed it. The lightning bolt struck Cole's coffin, and for some reason, it didn't destroy the boat or fry Zeke to a crisp because he was standing right next to him. I never really thought about that before. But, but just hear me out, man. You see, okay, the, the lightning bolt, like, recharged the cells in his body, and it kept him alive long enough for, for Zeke to build the machine so he can revive him, man. Like, like that's, that's some scientific shit right there. Okay, okay. L let me get this straight. You believe that a fat man who drinks beer and eats pizza for every meal and spies on women in the shower is going to be brilliant enough to build a machine that brings people back to life? Well, I mean, yeah, Zeke's, Zeke's cool. Why, wh why couldn't he build a machine like that? <laughs> yeah, okay, so you really believe that if that technology was available, the government wouldn't have discovered it years ago? Look, I don't need to listen to your, to your technical stuff, all right? Like, you're just trying to disprove my idea. You can't disprove it because it, it, it's obvious. Like, Cole's in there. Have you actually been inside this place? No. Did you see Zeke or Cole with your own eyes? Well, no. Then I want you to do me a favor. Shut up and get out. No, hold on, man, hold on. Just, just one more thing, just one more thing. <sighs> what? Happy April Fool's Day. That's it. You asked for it.